Hi, I'm Dr. John Sakala. I'm an assistant professor of teaching here at the Fogelman College of Business and Economics and the Department of Marketing and Supply Chain Management. My area of research, my stream focus, was always in sales and negotiation. One of the areas that we researched, and I was really of all the papers, the one I'm probably most proud of was one we did on what makes a sales presentation effective. What makes it effective? How do you know if it has been an effective presentation so we could help train our students? And about halfway through, we realized we need to make this a dyadic, a two-way study. We need to get the buyers in on this also. For the salespeople, for most of them, it was an effective presentation if they bonded, if they had a good feeling, if they got to talk and there were things in common. It was very personal getting to know and establish that relationship. That was effective for them. For the buyers, they couldn't have cared less about that part of it. The buyers wanted salespeople that knew the information, had product knowledge, market knowledge, that knew what they were talking about. And we were a little surprised at that at first, but the more we thought about it, we realized if I'm a buyer, I'm seeing two dozen people come across my desk that are warm and fuzzy and love me and scouting out photos on my wall and trying to find something to connect with. They didn't care about that because they were bombarded by that. What for a buyer was effective was a salesperson who knew their inventory, knew the competition, knew the buyer's market knew their customers' customers. If you came in prepared and had done your homework, that's effective for me. So we have these great findings and most research articles will have a managerial implications or application section. That's the kind of research I wanna to continue to do. Research that has application is relevant, that can be used by practitioners, it can help make them different. 